So can you join two Zoom meetings at the same time? Well, if you use only the Zoom desktop app or mobile app, you can't join two meetings simultaneously. Zoom will disconnect you from the first meeting before allowing you to join the second meeting. You can, however, join multiple meetings if you use a combination of devices or browser tabs. For example, you can join one meeting on the Zoom desktop app and then another meeting using the Zoom mobile app. Or you can use the desktop app for one meeting and a browser session for another meeting. However, with this second method, it will result in the audio from both meetings coming through the same set of speakers or your headphones, which isn't ideal. Interestingly, in Zoom support pages, they suggest that joining simultaneous meetings is an option that can be enabled in settings. However, when I had a look through my Zoom settings, I couldn't find the option they were referring to. So if I've missed it, please let me know in the comment section below. In this demonstration, you'll see I have two meetings scheduled for 5 p.m. and I'll connect to the first one I've arranged with Wilson. Having started my meeting with Wilson, if I then go to try and join my meeting with Herman, you'll see that the option to join is greyed out. I'll go into my calendar and open up my appointment with Herman. There I'll click on the link to the meeting, which will automatically open in a browser window. Now I'm prompted to launch the meeting in the Zoom desktop app, but by doing so, I get that message requesting that I first end the meeting I'm currently in with Wilson. If I go back into my browser window, this time rather than opening the meeting in the Zoom app, I'll click the cancel button. Zoom then gives me an additional option to join the meeting in a browser session. By choosing this option, I can be in both meetings simultaneously, one using the Zoom desktop app and the other in a browser tab. However, as I already mentioned, using this method will result in the audio from both meetings coming through my computer's speakers, which will be very confusing. To get around these audio issues, it's probably best to use different devices. And for this, I recommend having one meeting open in your desktop app and the other using Zoom's mobile app. At least then you can separate the two audio channels. Okay, and that's it. If you found the video useful, I'd appreciate you hitting the like button and you can subscribe for lots more videos and tips like this one. Until next time, thank you very much for watching.